Get the monkey a big bad toy store at the link in the description. Monkey, 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 and more. It's Steven's Monkey Reviews. Hey there, collectors, it's gonna be Steven here, and welcome to yet another, only two, Super Saiyan 4 SS4 unboxing video. SS4, just like SS, SS2, SS3, SS, G, S, S, B, S, S, there's no J. It's so validating. Anyway, today we have a look at the Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta SH figure arts from Dragon Ball GT. Oh yeah, finally, a year ago, we had Goku in the SH figure arts lineup in his Super Saiyan 4 form, and this year we have Vegeta. Of note as well, Goku got reissued, and last year I did a deluxe review for Goku, so if you are interested, go ahead and check out that review. Card should be popping up in the top right hand corner of the screen. Now we have another monkey boy in the lineup, and oh boy, I am super duper excited because we have Goku, we have Vegeta, we already have a Super Saiyan Blue Gogeta, Next year, we're gonna get Super 17. Anyway, enough of that. Let's go ahead and take a look at the box. So the front of the box, we have a nice shot of Vegeta using one of his attacks, Final Flash. At least that's what it's gonna look like here. We get a Final Shine attack. At least that's what it's gonna look like. Uh, the back of the box, we just have some promo pictures. Pretty cool, you can see some shots. So this way, if you haven't decided to pick them up yet, yeah. Yeah, maybe you will. Top and bottom and sides of the box are basically just going to go ahead and continue that window and manga style guide, even though there is, uh, there's, there's no, uh, manga for GT. I guess the, uh, Heroes manga is going to do it. But anyway, let's go ahead and switch on over to video and do a snap for editing purposes for me. So yes, SS4, that is, uh, in official solicitation by both, uh, uh, you, you know, the, these folks here, Bandai, and, uh, and, and, uh, and, and, and promotional materials. So, yeah, let's go ahead and open them up. There we go. So, we do have another, uh, Dragon Ball Games Battle Hour thingy. Which, here's how they do the, uh, instructions now. I don't know if I like that too, too much. But, it's pretty cool. Because it just tells you how to do the things. But, Yeah. Yeah, okay. Because there's no, there's no little extra pamphlets, no exciting promotional stuff. But here we go, here is everything, here are all the hand parts. Remember, this is not a full review, I'm going to talk about that in a second. So we get the typical smirking face, we get a gritting teeth angry face, we get a yelling face, and then we get neutral face. So Vegeta, I am super duper excited for this one, because so many years ago, it just seemed like we were just going to be staying put in uh you know the same old same old for z and then nothing same old gokus and an occasional villain maybe here or there you know we did get a vegeto or two and then finally we're getting some uh non-canon if you will stuff all right so there's just a quick look at the face plates we're here for the figure and just take a quick look at them get the first impressions so let's go ahead and just do a quick pop in of the tail all right so shoulders are very very firm not not tight i would say but they're they they overcompensated a bit on quality control i will say hips are not loose but they move rather smooth. Um, how are the ankles? My Goku had a slightly loose ankle. Yeah, I know that some people, uh, they, they're worried, maybe a little bit more so than they need to be, about the quality control from figures made in Vietnam. But, uh, Vegeta here, he, he, he checks out, he's pretty good. I like him. So something of note also, um, some people were um, pointing out that Vegeta has a different red for his fur than Goku. That's intended. Yeah. All right. So review status on Vegeta. Some folks are probably thinking that this is going to be something else that Steven uh, does an unboxing for, and then it just gets left in the pile. No, not him. There are four big reviews for this month that I want to get to. 
Vegeta is one of them. So I have a couple of other things that I got to get to that I'm going to fly through real quick because it's not going to take me too much long to do. And uh, Vegeta is going to be next up. So make sure, let's go ahead and switch on over to the outro here, that you are subscribed so this way you do not miss out because I've already got pretty much everything storyboarded out for Vegeta here. I know exactly how the review is going to flow. I know all the action shots, everything for this guy. So uh, the review should be pretty quick. Now we're going to go ahead and throw it on over to the end card for the patrons. So this way, hey, thank you so much for helping out. Times change, channel goes through changes, and yeah. Yeah, you, you do help support the channel because, uh, you know, DHL can uh, get stuff into my city literally within 12 hours. So uh, that helps me get things going faster. And then the end end cards this way. Everyone can check out other videos. They can check out other uploads. They can subscribe and check out social media because that's that's a thing. Thank you all so much for watching. I will catch you in the next video.